Even Firefighters Hug Their Moms by Christine Cole and illustrated by Mike Reed. My name is Big Frank and I'm a firefighter. Every morning I get up and look at the newspaper to find out where the fires are. Then I get dressed in my protective gear. My air tank and face mask help me breathe even if the smoke is as thick as a milkshake. I climb onto my hook and ladder truck and drive to the fire. Sometimes firefighter Sally comes with me. When I get to the fire, we rush into the burning building. How about a hug, my mom asks as I run by. Too busy fighting fires, I say. Even firefighters hug their moms, she says. My name is Officer Dave, and this is Rex, my police dog. We stand guard at the door, and when criminals come by, I announce it on the loudspeaker to warn everyone. Stand back, I say, criminals coming through. Then we lock up all the criminals in jail. My mom walks by. Don't you worry about your safety, ma'am, I say. We've got you covered. How about a hug, she asks. No time, I say, we've got to serve and protect. Even police officers hug their moms, she says. My name is Joe and I'm an EMT. That's short for emergency medical technician. My partner, Junior, is in training. I'm teaching her everything I know. Over the radio, we hear about an accident and we spring into action. We bandage up the man's cuts and scrapes and put him on a stretcher. We give him a bowl of ice cream to make him feel better. Then we race to the hospital. We keep the siren on the whole way. Wee you, wee you, wee you. My mom is waiting at the hospital. Can I have a hug, she asks when we get to the emergency room. Trying to save some lives here, I say. Even ambulance drivers hug their moms, she says. Maybe ambulance drivers do, I say, but I'm an EMT. My name is Dan. I'm a construction worker. I drive a front loader. I make uh, the yellow lash, light flash. When I back up, the beep, beep, beep tells everyone to get out of the way. Sometimes people watch me work. They ask if they can help. I say, thanks, but no. Better leave the heavy work to the pros. Can't you take a coffee break and give me a hug? My mom shouts. Coffee break's over, I shout back. Even construction workers hug their moms, she says. I'm Captain Steve. I'm a helicopter pilot. I work for the Coast Guard. I rescue people from their boats during hurricanes and tornadoes and other gigantic storms. My partner used a winch to pull them to safety. Can I hug a hero, my mom asks. I shake my head. It's just part of the job, I say. Even helicopter pilots hug their moms, she says. Wop, 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 go the blades. Sorry, I can't hear you, I yell, pointing up at the blades. My name is Sam. I'm the conductor of this train. Tickets, please, I call to the people waiting to get on. I take their tickets as they board. One of them tries to sneak a pig on board. No farm animals, I say. This is a passenger train. What do you get when you buy a ticket, a lady asks. 
You get a ride to Chicago, I say. Snacks? No, but you can buy food in the dining car. Hugs? No, no hugs. Only a ride to Chicago. Even conductors hug their moms, she says. Woo woo, goes the whistle. All aboard, I say. This train is leaving. My name is Neil, and I'm an astronaut. This is my rocket. Yesterday, I went to the moon. Don't believe anyone who tries to tell you it's made of cheese. It's made out of rock. Trust me. Today, I'm going to Mars. I radio mission control. When they give me the thumbs up, I blast off. What's Mars made of, my mom asks. I tell her, Legos. I'm surprised you came back, she says. I'm here to get my Lego men. Then I'm going back again, I say. Any chance you'll give me a hug first, she asks. No, I say, wait just a minute, Buster, she says. I gave you directions to Mars. A quick hug doesn't seem like too much to ask, I shrug. Well, it's a little hard to hug when you're wearing a bulky spacesuit. Huh, she says. Even astronauts hug their moms. Whenever a lady throws something out by mistake, I get it back for her. Sometimes the lady is so happy that she tries to give me a hug. I let her because... Even garbage truck drivers hug their moms, sometimes.